Yep. Why is it freezing? What's up? What's up? What's up, Miss Crane? Yes, Nurse Crane. How can I help you? I'm so sorry. I know Dr. Swansea wanted you to rest, but we have somewhat of a crisis. Uh-oh. A crisis, you say? Our supply of antiseptics is nearly depleted. I was hoping there was another box up here, but... Mm, this room is awful, but no antiseptics at all. What type of hospital are you running? Oh, no shit. No antiseptics. Well, they ran out! You have been away too long, Doctor. With and she still has a washer her fucking hands! Supplies have been running scarce for months now. I may have a solution. In France, during the war, drug shortage was a daily problem, and we had to use our wits to overcome the shortages. However do you mean? You make new if ones. combined correctly, certain household chemical products can be used in a pinch instead. Now, where's the hospital storeroom? The storeroom? Fat chance. This is the Pembroke, and space is luxury we don't have. Everything used to be stored in the old morgue. Perhaps I should look there first. Where is this morgue? It's the large building behind the hospital. You'll need to go in the back door because it's been sealed off for sanitary reasons. Take this key. It opens a small back entrance at the end hmm. of the narrow street. The abandoned morgue behind the hospital. A small door at the end of a narrow street. On my way then. Thank Sweet. you, Nurse. Hey, Zeptic! You wanted to watch. You were starting to watch the series on YouTube, then I went live. Oh, rip. Yep. Um, I cannot enter. Okay. So this this nurse, she needs to wash her fucking hands for reals. She has had those hands have been bloody for like two days. What's this? Patient Thomas Elwood, mage tw male, age twenty eight, followed by Doctor Tippett, status convalescence. Administered admission is on September 16th. Day of release to be determined. Patient's face has been heavily burnt and disfigured by a bomb during the war. Even with the use of the strongest sedatives, he affirms to regularly endure severe pain from the wounds. As if the flames are still burning from under the skin, he says. Examinations of the... I can't even pronounce that. Carterize? Is that supposed to be carterize? I can't pronounce that. Tissue shows no place of information. Uh, infection or swelling. Scars are clean. Could it be a case of persistent nerve damage? The patient never ceases to blame himself for the disfiguration. Could it be a case of guilt of the survivor? Phantom pain manifestation as punishment for not dying with his comrades. Yeah, survivor's guilt is really sad. I feel bad for him. Poor dude. Poor, poor dude. Um, I can't get in there. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, so now we are... We're level six now, which is awesome. Can I go in here now? Dude. You hired me for a reason. Okay. So we need to go to the old morgue. We also still need to get... Um, still need more things. Let's see. What, what else are we doing? Um, so the main quests. Where can I see the side quests? Maybe the side quests are just within these things here. Like, if I could cure his fatigue, maybe she'll be happy with me? Maybe. I don't know. I feel like I have to talk to these guys. I don't think I talked to Tippett yet. I did talk to Brannigan. There's still two more other people I haven't talked to. Oh, and then he's dead. We killed him. Okay. Can I talk to you about your uh, Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening, fucking Dr. charging people for beds? Can I do that yet? Not yet. Okay. Goodbye, Nurse Hawkins. Here's a vampire lady. She still thinks she's a vampire. Um, who are you? Yes. Dr. Oh, it's you. God, fucking wash your hands. Don't you ever rest? You always work the nights. Don't you ever sleep? At the Pembroke, we're always hands on deck. When do you Your sleep? dedication to the Pembroke does you credit, Nurse Crane, but when do you sleep? We staff get our sleep when we can, Doctor. Nursing is a vocation, not the labor of a journeyman. Lack of sleep and the medical profession always ends in disaster. I've witnessed many a colleague succumb to stimulants to fight exhaustion. Drugs were as deadly as bullets in the trenches. London's trenches start here at Pembroke Hospital. We are on the front line, make no mistake. 
Okay. Well, uh, where is the morgue? Please, could you point me in the direction of the morgue again? It's the large, boarded-up building behind the hospital. You can't okay. miss it. The key cool. I gave you will open the small back door to it. Sweet. Um, I could ask her how the situation exactly here, but she's going to tell me the same thing. The supply situation here at Pembroke. It really depends. Doctor Swansea deftly works his society contacts for monies, but with <clears> the quarantine, well, we're in God's hands. That's all for now, Nurse Crane. Thank you. Maybe the blood on her hands is unwashable. It could be blood color scar. You know what I think it is? She got into the Kool-Aid. She got into the Kool-Aid. That's probably what happened. Evening, Mr. Elwood. Evening, Dr. Reed. Um. Why do you feel responsible oh, for the Oh, I gotta know this. What really happened? I wasn't disfigured by any German shells. <gasps> oh, he tried to kill himself? No. Or was an accident. What really happened? Tell me what really happened then? I went with a whore in Rouen. Dead drunk I was. The hotel was a shithole. Oh. There was a fire that night. Did you start the fire? Were you trying to avoid going back to the front? That's not uncommon, you know. No. It's just that I was asleep when the flames reached the room. The girl was long gone. Bitch mm. never woke me up. Left me to burn. Wow, Dr. Crane, only naughty girls get into the Kool-Aid without permission. Why is that about it? Come on. It's one thing to come back disfigured by the Germans. And it's another to get injured in an accident that could have happened to anybody. Hmm. Well, you can't hide forever. Surgery could help. Beauty's not everything. Um... Beauty's not everything. Beauty is not everything, Mr. Elwood. Says Mr. Pretty Face. Oh, what? Okay, can we try that again? Beauty says Miss. Oh, I fucked it up. Well, I wanted to get that hint, but maybe we'll have to get a hint from someone else. Okay. All right, let's try to find this morgue. I like the fact that if you talk to people, you'll get hints about their lives, and then you can actually delve into them. I mean, that is the way to get better blood, which is pretty cool. Okay, let's go it this way. I understand you must be very angry about this unfair situation. I managed to arrange to have you buried in the same mass grave as your wife. Oh yeah, that's right. That might help. He's over here. In this Thelma makeshift Halkoff morgue. said she was being watched by vampire hunters. Where are they hiding? I should investigate. Oh yeah, and then she said she was also being watched by vampire hunters. Wonder where her room is. Is this um? Oh yeah, we talked to him already. He's kind of a jerk. Um. Okay. So if we go this way, we'll get to the morgue. I also wouldn't mind trying to do some of these other things. Let's see, if I go over here, maybe I could do this one instead. Uh, details, no wait. Let's do that one, let's track this one. Cause this one's pretty far away and I have to fight a bunch of people, but if I do this one, that would be pretty cool. All right, so I guess the vampire hunters are this way? Where on the map are they? Oh, they're just in the area. Okay, so if they're in these, just in this area, then we can just kind of look around, right? Assuming. Hmm. So I wonder where these vampire hunters are after Miss Hawkins. Okay, so they're just in this general area. <laughs> All right, so let's use our vampire skills to do some uh, sleuthing. Probably someone on the second floor? Or do you think maybe she's just talking about this guy? Let's talk to him. Maybe he knows about these vampire hunters that are after her. Such a pleasure to see you again. Um. Hmm. 
Goodbye, Mr. Chidan. I guess he doesn't have anything for us. I guess I could talk to her again, maybe? Maybe ask her where she's seen these uh, vampire hunters at? Where was she? She's around here somewhere, right? Miss Hawkins? Where is she? There she is. Let's talk to her. Thelma! Good evening, Miss Howcroft. How are you tonight? I need blood, Doctor. Warm, rich, vibrant blood. Tell me about Thomas Elwood? Tell me, Thelma. Why do you feel so attached to Mr. Elwood? Why him? I'm... I, I'm not sure, Doctor. I think we have a bond of some sort. We've both suffered so much. He's the only mortal I... I find interesting. Uh, are you romantically involved? You say Ooh. And Mr. Elwood are romantically involved. No. No, Thomas is a delicate soul. Even though he disguises it. But I am not the woman he needs. No, for I am a vampire, Doctor. She's a vampire. Do you plan to make him a vampire? Do you plan to make him a vampire too? Of course not. How could I inflict my curse on anybody else? I'm not that cruel, Doctor. Okay. So she says she's being hunted. Hmm. We still need to I'll do some leave other you, things. Mistress of the dark, to your nocturnal activities. Dude, Jonathan's really slick. Okay, I can't go out this way. Excuse me? Can I go out this way? Yes, I can go out this way. Okay, cool. She is kind of a crazy person. She thinks she's a vampire. It's locked, all right. So... Find out who is spying on her. So who's spying on her, then? Obviously, it's someone in this area right here. Because the moment I get into this area, this little thing goes away. Right over here. So the only person I can see is Rakesh. I don't see... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Are those peoples? Oh, that's peoples. We gotta get up there. Them some peoples. Alright, let's go up there. These guys are obviously the ones that are spying on her, right? Yeah, it has to be. But how do I get up there? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, wait, first, grab this. Does this vampire have to be invited to places? I don't know. Hide. Oh, here we go. Hide. Oh, it takes a whole minute to undo itself? Okay, well, let's see. All right, well, it's pretty easy for me to kill these guys. Someone do it. Ready? Blood spear! Oh, I should be using a gun more often. Instead of using a stake. There we go. Oh, yeah, I should really be using a gun more often. That works so well. All right. Is this it? Survey mission! Object, vampire TV hospital survey investigate. Three days ago, one of our new recruits heard a rumor about the presence of a female vampire hiding in Pembroke Hospital. All we have is her first name, Thelma. Your mission is to discreetly go in there and observe any of suspicious activity concerning said leech. Then report directly back to us, and we will decide what action should be taken. Well, we found, uh, who's, you know, spying on her. Real-life vampire hunters. Oh, yeah. Well, that was easy. Okay. Let's go tell her the good news. We've protected her. What was this? 
Join your, their king and country needs you. Join the British ranks. Hmm. That's right, there's a war right now. There's a war going on. All right. Got to go, Ginger. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. See you next time. All right, let's go tell her the good news. Um, she's like over here. God, I get so turned around in this place. So she's across the hall. Nope. She's across the hall. Wait. Oh, there she is. She's still here. All right. Let's tell her the good news. Good evening, Miss Halcroft. How are you tonight? Personal questions. Tell me about vampires. Tell me, Thelma. What do you really know about vampires? I saw one and he saw me. I watched him hunt and kill. I saw his terrible wounds heal as his victim died. And then I knew I was saved. You mean you actually saw a vampire? Here in London? Yes. And it has been the answer to my pain. I must drink and kill to regenerate my decaying body. I am a vampire too. You know nothing about vampires. You're delusional. You could be in danger. Uh, okay, so obviously if I do this wrong, then I lose the chance to get the hint. <sighs> She's quite healthy. Oh no, I have all three hints. Well, you're delusional. You are no vampire. You are a delusional woman. Convinced she is something she is not. How convenient to call delusional anyone who does not share your precious rationale, Dr. Reed. Well, we got all of them. Yeah, we got all the hints. Oof, yeah. I'll leave you, Mistress of the Dark, to your nocturnal activities. All right, so if we look at her thing, we should be done now, right? We got all of them. Yeah, we got all of them. But wait, why is it still... Oh, wait, there's more. Oh, there's more guards. Okay. So this is just an ongoing quest, then. Good to know. Oh, nope. Wrong one. Wrong room. How could I destroy that woman's hopes and dreams of being a vampire? Well... She is quite delusional, but she does play a sweet game with the other guy. She's very sweet about it. Let's go over here. Okay. So the old morgue is right over here. Let's trash, get some grease and screws. Yum. All right, so this is the old morgue, eh? Wow. This game is quite terrifying. Like the scenery and everything? Did I see something glow over here? I guess not. I could have sworn I saw something glow. Alright, open this door. How's the tortured sand with your tortured man? Those tortured sands. Full of, full of tortured men's night boys. Night, boys. Oh, Ooh, hey, what's this? Ah, uh, glass vials. All right. Um, do you? Th what are the chances here? There's going to be like another one of those skulls. Let's take a look and see. Just to make sure. There might be like something here that's going to like try to attack me. I know it. It's over here. Oh, it just takes me out. No! Go back in! <sighs> Didn't mean to do that. Go back in here. God. Okay. The old morgue. It's healthy status. All right, let's look around. Let's not go out that door again. Uh, excuse me? Did you guys hear that? You guys heard that, right? It sounded like the dude was in here. All right. Hey. 
Anything in here? This is pretty spooky. Yep. Some pig. Some pig man's in here. Is there a reason behind the spelling of vampire? I mean, I think that's more of like an old world spelling of it. Oh, yeah. I knew there was going to be something here. Let's see. He doesn't have any resistances to blood magic, so I'm going to blood spear this fool. Bite him! Get that big gulp thirst. William Bishop. Must be the same strain. This sickness moves faster than influenza. Interesting. So you're saying is we have an epide epidemic of vampires, eh? Also, I don't understand why I'm not the key will surely grant me access to the base piercing their hearts after I kill them. So that's what the other vampire lady showed me. She showed me how to pierce their hearts. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Get off of me! I didn't even see him! I didn't even see this guy! I didn't even see him! Get dead. Where did this guy come from? Wah! Was that a zombie? No, they're they're feral vampires known as skulls. S K, is it S K O L or S K A L? I can't remember. Um, you're supposed to be more feral and like crazed. Ah, oh, bullets. Bullets. He came from the future. Seems like it. All right. Uh, is there any other rooms I can go to? Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Sometimes I think there's something there that I can like uh, interact with, but it's like just like a shiny piece of like it's something locked. else. Ugh. Do you know how one becomes feral? No, not yet. We're still learning our own nature. Mars, fortifiers. <laughs> as popular as they are ineffective. But they do contain iron tartrate, and that might prove itself useful. Yeah, no, we, we, we don't really know yet. We just got bit, and then uh, Lady Vampire was like, Oh, you're such a child! And then she saved her life. Watery rich blood sample. Gross. All right. Well, looks like there's more stuff, but they're in these rooms that I can't get into. Can't Jimmy unlock? No. I wish. Ugh, this music is spoopy. Such spoopy music. I wish I could just break this I door down. Enter. Ugh. It sucks. I imagine there's something I'm not seeing. Probably have to go around the building to get in there. Alright, so if I can't go that way, I'm gonna go back downstairs. You love the spoops? Oh. What was that? Okay, something, something made a noise. Spoop me. Right, there's two more guys down here. Great. So I'm just going to do a little blood spear on this dude. There you go. Get dead. Now the other guy got to shoot. These skulls feed from corpses and the husks of animals. They're not after blood. Ah, get off me! 
Get off me! Give me your, give me your blood. I need to get that big thirst back. There we go. Now he's dead. Cool. All right. So yeah, I guess these skulls are just ghouls then, because they seem to feed off the corpses and not the blood. It's weird. Oof. Yeah, look at that. Some bright red blood. Can I go? Nope, can't go that way. Cannot go that way. Alright, let's keep looking in this room, I guess. Maybe there's something we missed in here while we're fighting these guys. Yep. Totally missed these shillings. Anything in here? Oh, this music's so spooky! I'm worried this guy is just going to get up and attack me. Local investigation. The new citizen is, invest is available to investigate. Okay. Uh, death report. Citizen, citizen investigations are displayed here and categorized by district. You can start a new citizen quest by tracking it. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Ca find the cause of the death. Okay. So we still got to do hers. It seems fairly open-ended, so I could probably do all of this. Cool. Office of Pembroke Hospital, medical examination, report of investigation, Samuel Connor. Cacazoid. Cacazoid? Cacazoid. Cacazoid. Why? 39 years old, male, fisherman. Cause of death is natural. Fast progression pneumonia by virus-induced pulmonary consolidation. Spanish influenza. Dr. Cor... Koran Tippets, Nurse Gwyneth Brannigan. Name and signature of medical examiner Tippets. Mr. Connor's injuries don't match the report. Yeah, it doesn't. I'd better look into this. It's locked. Yeah, it's, it sure is luck. Ooh. You just acquired a new type of offhand weapon. Ooh. Press it, equip it, and press Y to directly absorb blood? Excuse me? I have a blood absorbing thing? Dragon's vein. Or I could just attack with a fucking sword. Ancient sword with the Latin phrase engraved on the blade has long been forged by whales during the 16th century. Uh, I'm just going to use a fucking sword. Oh, unequip. Okay. Can I uh, uh, upgrade my sword? Weird. Okay, well, I'm, I'm, I guess I'll, I'll do this. Dude, I got a sword. Okay, well, oh yeah, this guy, this guy. Uh, corner of the lips. Traces Let's look at this guy's lips. Traces of a pinkish foam at the corner of the lips. Some sort of drug overdose, perhaps? Okay. Multiple abrasions and scarring on the arms and legs. Old and distinctive injuries of a sailor or a fisherman. Okay. Uh, I guess let's open his chest. The Ew. chest was originally open to perform the operation. The sutures are clean, but the chest has been reopened. The fuck? A puncture over the left lung. Possibly Where do you even see that? Not the cleanest work, but I think it was successful. Signs of internal bleeding. So, Dr. Tippett's anesthetics were incorrectly dosed, causing the patient's death. Oh, God. And then he tried to operate on him again. Tippett has made an egregious error. It's time we talked. Oh, is Tippett the guy that was Tippett like? Has made an egregious error. It's time we talked. Oh, is Tippett the one that was like, I'm against locked, all right. experimentation? It's because he probably killed a man. Which is Dr. Tippett's? Tippett was this guy. 
Oh, I don't think we've even met him yet. Oh, we met Ackroyd. Yeah, he was the one that's against experimentation. He has like a new form of medical thing that he wants to try on this dude. This guy, we still haven't met yet. Okay. So you gotta go find him. Obviously, he did. He didn't know. He did it bad. Ooh, 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 ooh. I do want to get into that chest, though. I wonder how do I get into this chest? Cause it's locked right now. Can I just break it? Ugh, I want to break it. Dude, I got a fucking sword. I got a sword. Got one of them S words. Oh, God. All right, dude. Get ready for the sword. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. That's a good one. Sword's the best. All right, so this is the room I could have came out of. Okay. So we were, we were had to fight him anyways. Okay. Cool. Uh, is there anything else I can collect? No? Okay. It's been here. Hello? Any, any, any ghouls? Oh yeah, there's one. Excuse me? John Doe? What? Oh god. Get off me! No! This is boss fight. Eat his blood! Heal! Eat him! Take a big bite! I'm out of bullets? Crap, I'm out of bullets. Oh god. Okay, um... Kill myself. There you go. Eat him! Replenish! There we go! Wow! I'm not sure I can defeat them without becoming stronger. To drink blood is so tempting. Oh, yeah. Sodium hypochlorite. Dangerous to administer, but efficient in the proper dosage. Vamps with swords. I got a sword. I feel really good about that. All right, do I do I take the stairs or I take the lazy way up? I guess I have to take the lazy way up. There you go. All right. So yeah, I guess I guess we need to figure out how we're going to um who we need to kill next, right? Analyze this. Let's recycle these for items. Cool. We could upgrade our sword. Where is our sword? Enhance damage or increase blood absorption. <gasps> I kind of want blood absorption. How do I, how do I, how do I upgrade? Oh, I need some more common handle parts. Okay. So I can't do that yet. Um, she said I needed. Ooh, that's nice. I do need that. She said I needed something, right? I came down here for specific things, right? We could get fatigue and help our friend out. So, okay, let's do this. Let's look at what we have to cure. 
In the hospital, we have one person that needs cure, and he has fatigue. So let's cure him with fatigue. So let's get him some tea. There we go. So now we have one cure for fatigue. Um, <laughs> regenerate 60 blood points instantly. Watery rich blood, ergo tame or tamine, and opium. My god. Amazing. All right. That's how you get 60 points worth of blood back. Opium. Okay, I'm clearly not there yet. Okay, let's keep going. So what's the story behind this game? We are Jonathan Reed. We are turned into a vampire. We don't know why and who did it. And we're trying to figure out who, who, the, who the head vampire is that's turning people. So we teamed up with Dr. Swansea, who's like a um, Victorian day. Ah! He's like a Victorian day. Um, what's that dude's name? Um, ah, shit. Uh, what's his name? Who's the vampire hunter in those stories in Dracula? Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Um, Helsing. He's like a Helsing. Because he, he knows what we are. And he's willing to help us, so. Okay, well, I couldn't get any more of your blood. It's insane how these things, like, respawn. I'm, I'm not complaining. There's some good stuff down here. Alright. Did everything respawn, though? Maybe not. Okay. get into this door though it's locked all right I really want to get in there I guess we're just gonna leave which I'm fine with I'm fine with wait how do I leave <laughs> uh, excuse me how, how, how do you leave oh I guess I have to get on the main floor one main floor here we go aha this is how we leave gotcha okay Oof. Kill vampires, get into room without key. Yeah, uh, exactly, you vault. I don't understand why. Jazz, why don't I like the hats? Because I want to see my awesome hair. This guy is good looking. I don't want to cover up that, that awesome hairdo. It's got some real good looking hairdos. Updos. All right. No, I can see citizens. I understand what I'm looking for. All right, we're supposed to find Nurse Crane. Oh, it's Kira. Wait, we talked to you yet? Oh. There's someone unknown that we've never talked to before. He's outside. All right, Nurse Crane. Finally, you've returned, Doctor. Did you find anything of value? Yes, Nurse. You've worked your first miracle, Doctor. Now, this patient here needs immediate treatment. Duty calls? When the storm has passed, I'll show you how to mix the remedy yourself with the same basic ingredients. Many thanks, Doctor. When you've finished, you ought to report to Dr. Swansea in his office. He's been looking for you. Seemed pressing. Hmm. Diseases can decrease the blood quality of the citizen. Use the correct medicine to heal him.